Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to make this cute card. This features the brand new stamp set, A Wash With Flowers, that's coming out in the Summer Mini Catalog. And um, this is a really fun water technique, water coloring technique. So um, this is a project that my online Cards and Projects Club is doing this month. Uh, so I will show you how we make it. I'm going to start with a base of Bermuda Bay cardstock, and I cut the paper long ways. And I scored it for easier folding. Now I'm going to take a piece of the shimmery white cardstock, and I have mounted my flowers from the Awash with Flowers stamp set on one block. Uh, it comes actually in two different kits if you get the clear mount. Uh, this is the inside, so you would stamp the outline in black and then stamp the inside right on top of it in a color. But today we're going to watercolor with aqua painters instead. So I am going to take my stays on ink and ink this up really well. And actually, I probably should stamp my greeting, but that's okay. I'll stamp that right on there. And then for my greeting, I'm actually using a different stamp set. I'm using the Well Scripted stamp set. Uh, I'm going to make this for my mom, so I'm going to use the Wonderful Mother sentiment and just place it right where I want it. It's a little crooked. Okay. Start over on the other side. Even with the clear mount, you still have to pay attention to whether or not you're stamping straight. Okay. There we go, much better. Okay, now I'm going to take my aqua painter. And the aqua painters, you fill this cavity with water and you squeeze to get the brush wet. See the water come down in through there? So, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to color in. Go ahead and get this wet. And it's clear, it's just water. And then I'm going to pick up some of my crushed curry ink and as you can see, it just kind of spreads around since the paper's already wet. And it's watercoloring, so you don't want it to be all exactly even. There we go, and when you're finished, you just scribble on your scratch paper. Now I'm going to do the same thing for these little flowers and I'm going to do them in Bermuda Bay this time. There we go. Now I'm going to take my So Saffron marker and I'll use the thicker edge and just draw right over the stems. Perfect. Okay, now we can put our card together. I'm going to take a three-quarter circle punch and I'm going to punch out some circles to add a tone-on-tone -tone interesting, as you can see in the card it has some little polka dots there. Right, let's start with a piece of Crushed Curry DSP. I'll just line that up along the bottom and then I want this to be like that so that I can tie the ribbon around it. So I'll lay my ribbon down, lay that down and then lay that down on top of that. I'll take my ribbon and tie a knot. And then my ribbon scissors, snip those right off. And now the little polka dots. I'm just going to add these kind of scattered all over.
and I have that little extra piece, so I'll just take my snips and snip that right off. And there you have it, a great Mother's Day card using a brand new stamp set, a wash with flowers. Thanks for watching. Bye.